Bombshell, feds break their silence on Comey, he's in deep trouble land. James Comey will go down in history as the petty FBI director who sold his soul to the deep state. He's a man of little integrity, who abused his office to try to hurt our president. Now, Comey's in big trouble. Deputy Attorney General, Rod Rosenstein, has just informed the public that James Comey broke FBI protocol by leaking memos to the press about his meetings with President Trump via Washington Examiner. Comey has destroyed his own career. In an interview, Rosenstein was asked if it's proper for an FBI director to take notes of his meeting with a U.S. president and then let the press have those notes. Rosenstein's response burned James Comey. As a general proposition, you have to understand the Department of Justice. We take confidentiality seriously, so when we have memoranda about our ongoing matters, we have an obligation to keep the confidential. He couldn't have put it any more clearly. To emphasize, he added, I think it is quite clear. It's what we were taught, all of us prosecutors and agents. In other words, even rookie agents know they're supposed to treat sensitive information with utmost confidentiality. Leaking notes of conversations with the president to the press is something that no respectable agent would ever contemplate doing. It completely flies in the face of the FBI's reputation for professionalism. But Comey thought he was above the law. Nut job Comey, as President Trump referred to him, had no qualms doing what he did, even though he personally had nothing to gain with his completely unethical action. It appears he did it for one reason, he's been bought by the big money interests who want to bring Trump down. If James Comey were really the true blue FBI man he pretends to be, he wouldn't have gone along like a stooge with a rampant law breaking under the Obama administration. Think about everything he let slide. First. Comey did absolutely nothing to hold Hillary Clinton accountable for her storage and transmission of classified materials on a private unsecured email server. When Obama's attorney general, Loretta Lynch, instructed Comey to call the Clinton investigation a matter, he did absolutely nothing to uncover the cover-up playing out under his nose. He closed his eyes and plugged his ears when Lynch met with Bill Clinton on a tarmac in the middle of an investigation into his wife. What about Obama's use of the IRS to target conservative groups? What about Fast and Furious? What about the hostage ransom secretly paid to Iran? Did any of these unethical and illegal scandals ever constitute cause for concern for James Comey? No. The moment he met Trump, he began keeping notes of their conversations. Rosenstein should be watched with a wary eye as well. He's a Democrat, and he's the one who appointed Mueller to lead the investigation into Russian collusion. Mueller has filled his team with pro-Hillary shills. Nevertheless, there's no doubt Comey disgraced his office with what he did to Trump. We Americans will not forget it. Nut job Comey will never work in government again. He deserved to have his illicit ties exposed and then be thrown in the big house. What punishment does Comey deserve for his treasonous actions? Share this story on Facebook and let us know because we want to hear your voice.